As a chiropractor, I get asked all kinds of questions about the human body. What is that popping sound with an adjustment? Why does my back hurt when I sneeze? Do I need to go see a physical therapist or a chiropractor for my injury? These are just a few of the questions I get daily. My name is Dr. Sandy Baird. In today's video, I'm going to share with you the top five frequently asked questions that I get. So hit that like button and stay tuned. So question number one that I get almost daily is what is that popping, clicking, or cracking sound that happens during a chiropractic adjustment? And rest assured, it's not your bones breaking or cracking in any way. It all has to do with the joint capsule. This occurs because the nitrogen gas within the joint capsule rushes to fill in the partial vacuum created when the joints are slightly separated. This is the same sound that you'd hear when you pop open a can of soda or when you pop a champagne bottle. And not all chiropractic adjustments make those audible noises called cavitations. So question number two is, my pain feels more joint related or my pain feels more muscular related and I'm not really sure who I should see, a massage therapist or a chiropractor. Can a chiropractor help me? So I would say that this all comes down to the chicken or the egg, right? Things don't happen in isolation. We have muscles that get tight. We have joints that stop moving properly and they usually happen at the same time. It's hard to know which is causing the other one, right? So that's where the chicken and the egg comes in. Is it the tight muscles that have already gotten tight and are pulling on the joint and creating a position of either being out of alignment or being restricted and not able to move the other direction? Or is it the fact that the joints were already stuck through sitting too long or repetitive movement or what have you and the muscles have pulled tight as a result? Either way, we have to look at both pieces of the puzzle. And as a sports chiropractor, I can do chiropractic adjustments and I can also do manual therapy so that we're definitely addressing the whole picture. Question number three, if I go to a chiropractor once, do I have to keep going for the rest of my life? Choosing chiropractic care is a lot like choosing to eat healthy or choosing to be active. So you could eat an apple and go to a Zumba class and that's better than not doing those things. But if you consistently make those things a priority, you're gonna move more in the direction of health. Same with chiropractic care. So even if you're not feeling any pain, coming in for a chiropractic checkup is similar to coming in for a dental checkup. We just wanna keep the body moving and feeling good. And Chiropractic care is no more addictive than apples or Zumba, so we just want to choose the frequency of care that supports the healthy active lifestyle that you want. Question number four, are chiropractic adjustments painful? If a joint hasn't been moving properly in a long time, things might feel a little bit sore the night of the chiropractic adjustment or even the day after. But generally, chiropractic adjustments feel good. A lot of my patients even report that they feel like a sensation of like pressure being released or lightness or more flexibility or looseness. They, they tend to use words like that. So generally it feels good. It drives me crazy seeing chiropractic adjustments portrayed in social media. There is this glorification or amplification of the audible sound, that cavitation, that popping sound that we talked about. And that leaves patients with the idea that an adjustment is going to be painful. Like there's no other way around it. If I go see a chiropractor, it's gonna hurt like what I see on social media. And that is so far beyond the truth. I offer gentle adjustments. I offer adjustments with more oomph but still in a skilled, gentle, honoring way. And I hate seeing on these social media pages, these like just giant chiropractic adjustments. The Y strap is one of the, I won't even, okay, I'm just, I'm ranting, I'm ranting. I don't wanna turn this into a rant, but I do wanna point out that not all chiropractic adjustments are painful. Most of them are not painful. I get adjusted by my chiropractor. They're very skilled, very gentle, it feels great. I've gotten adjusted by many different colleagues and other chiropractors over the years. They've for the most part all felt great. So there's no need to assume that it's gonna feel painful because of what you see on social media. Question number five that I get frequently is, is chiropractic care safe for pregnant people? So yes, not only is chiropractic care safe for pregnant folks, it's actually very beneficial. With the growth of the baby and the body expanding, there's all kinds of extra pressure that's put on the spine, the ligaments, and the other tissues of the body. Chiropractic care can help adjust the joints, keep things moving well, and we can do manual therapy to take the tension off the muscles that are getting overly tight. Other than being aware of the contraindications to adjusting a pregnant person, the things that may look a little bit different when adjusting someone who's pregnant may be that the adjustments are a little bit more gentle in some areas, and then also there's more pillows, bolsters, supports needed just to support the growing belly. The American Pregnancy Association also can provide more information about chiropractic care during pregnancy. I hope you learned a lot in this video. If you have any questions about chiropractic, please feel free to leave them in the description box. And if you'd like more health tips, you can subscribe to my channel right over here. And there's another video you might be interested in right over here as well. All right, thank you for watching. We'll see you on the next one.